Thanks so much, Amelia. Well, the race for Missouri's open U.S. Senate seat was among the races in the spotlight. This morning, Missouri's new senator-elect is Republican Eric Schmidt. Yeah, he defeated his opponents, including Democrat Trudy Bush Valentine. Fox News' Chris Rie is live in downtown with details on the results. Chris? We're on John. Good morning to both of you. It was a spirited campaign with Schmidt and Bush Valentine criticizing each other for months over multiple issues. In the end, though, the voters spoke pretty clearly. The Associated Press, uh, re press calling the race relatively early, just after 9 o'clock last night. With all precincts reporting this morning, Schmidt won with 55% of the vote, while Bush Valentine received 42%. Schmidt is, of course, Missouri's current attorney general and has held past positions, including Missouri state treasurer and a state senator. Bush Valentine is a nurse and a member of the Anheuser-Busch family. This was her first run for political office. Take a look at video from the watch parties of both Schmidt and Bush Valentine. Schmidt was leading in the polls before Election Day. Both Schmidt and Bush Valentine spoke at their respective events last night. You will hear from Schmidt first. Tonight is about all the regular, hard-working Missourians who've suffered the last two years, those who've been left behind, people who work hard every day and want their children to inherit America they've known and loved. These folks are the heart and soul of America, and I will be their champion in the United States Senate. We spread our message of protecting our democracy, restoring women's freedom to choose, fighting for working families, and preserving Missouri farms. We may not have won this race, but we, we made great strides in Missouri. Schmidt is replacing Roy Blunt, who is retiring from the Senate. Blunt tweeting, Missourians made the right choice in sending Eric Schmidt to the U.S. Senate. I congratulate the Schmidt family, campaign staff, and supporters on a well-deserved victory. And we understand Governor Parson will appoint a new attorney general once Schmidt takes his position in the Senate. For now, live downtown, Chris Renier, Fox News.